Realistic is a uh, Golden Boy versus Matchroom Card, maybe with uh, Canelo versus Andre, and then Tevin Farmer versus Jojo well, we, we Diaz. We want the Andre fight. I mean, I feel bad for Andre that Canelo doesn't want to seem to fight him, and maybe Golovkin as well. But he's just got to keep winning. Unfortunately, uh, the fight is no longer an undisputed fight because of the WBC franchise situation, and I think that maybe affected Andre's chances of getting that fight because. An undisputed fight would have been very attractive. So, yeah, look, you know, Golden Boy and us obviously putting fights together all the time, and the Jojo Diaz fight, it shouldn't be difficult to make. I mean, Diaz wants to fight, um, Tevin wants to fight. I love the Bachelt fight as well, if Bob fancies that one. Um, always keeping him warm for Lomachenko, I don't know. But, but Bachelt, <laughs> Farmer unification is a great fight. Um, so is the Tank Davis fight, but, but certainly. I say well, worse. give us what about my Marine? Who? What about my, my, my Marine? It was the WBO. Yeah, Harry. We'll we'll have him as well. That'd be great. Yeah. That'd Fighting be a great fight. Marine. Let's yeah, do it. Do that as well. He's got a mandatory first. Isn't he? He's fighting a roach. Where? Uh, set up to nine. November nine. Yeah. November nine. Oh no, November we we too happy. We can't wait for that. <laughs> I'll be back in the ring by November. Eddie, how much does it bother you that that WBC franchise, that make believe belt, is messing with your business? <laughs> <laughs> I thought I saw Jose in here today too, by the way. Um, it's great <laughs> <laughs> if you're the franchise champion. <laughs> you know, if you if you're a champion, and it's a way to avoid mandatories and a way to fight whoever you want. And even better, if you get beat, you're still champion. Shouldn't the mandatory, shouldn't the number one contender be legitimately a really good fucking fighter? Yes. Like, shouldn't that be a really fucking good fighter so people about, want to see the number Dino's one contender? Chinese guys, who's a mandatory for <laughs> <laughs> No, but, but that that's get, gets to this whole, I mean, the, th the thing about this franchise champion thing that troubles me in general is that it, 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 if, if the thing is, the system is working right, if the system is working right, you want to see the number one contender. He's earned the right to be there. Now, when was the system working right? Hasn't worked right in, and forever. Yeah, but it, but when you start making franchise champions and the organization itself is saying, oh, fuck our own mandatory, they're almost hitting the point where they're going to start destroying themselves. I mean, because at that point, what does their belt mean? Well, they have I'll, a, I'll they give you an interim. Interim champ, franchise champ, golden champ, silver champ, Mayan champ, pearl fucking champ. pearl champ. Amir Khan is a pearl champ. <laughs> <laughs> what does that even mean? But, but it's, I'll give you a perfect example of a scenario, right? You've got, in my opinion, the best young fighter in the world over there in Devin Haney. Right? Honey. He's fighting, or due to fight, a final eliminator against Abdullah. The only reason he wants to fight Abdullah is to become mandatory for Lomachenko. Lomachenko. Franchise. Lomachenko, once he gets beat by Luke Campbell, <laughs> <laughs> might rematch. Well, then you can make it. Then, then you can no, but then Luke Campbell will make it. Ask Luke Campbell. Yeah, but the problem it. is, you're going to fight. What will happen is, in that situation, I don't yeah. blame I don't blame you, yeah. but you're going to fight Commie, right. and then he's going to become the franchise champion. Right. So yes. Devin never gets a shot at Lomachenko. Oh, well, so that, number that one, may very well be because no. he signed with the wrong company. Oh. There you go. Oh. Now we're now, now we're getting down to the nitty gritty. Now, 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 now. This is what we're talking about. This is that. That's what we're talking about. But in all seriousness, it makes you not want to fight a final. Why should Devin Haney fight a final eliminator? He's not. He you know, that's what I'm saying. I know, but it's the first time me and you have agreed for so, weeks. So don't feel <laughs> it as a final eliminator. Well, no, no, we're not going to feel it. But, but, it right. but here's another weird thing that's about to happen. They're not going to recognize the BC regular belt as a unification because the franchise. Yeah, right, because it's it's not who's the real champion. Not the real champion. Real champion. Yeah. Wow. We could talk about it. These are things that go behind the scenes, y'all. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Tevin just wants a burger, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. Tevin. Tevin. Yeah. 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 Okay, I'm in a press conference. I'm talking too much. They're all laughing at me. All these Brits, you know, <laughs> that, that, that subscribe and support the British Board of Boxing Control. Homer. Be careful, Homer, you got a fight coming.